The next award is for best music and the winner is Resilient. Congratulations! My name is Sunil Vaswani. I am the CEO and founder of Serena Film Productions. I started making films only two years ago, but I've been part of films all my life. I studied fine arts and studied dance, but my passion is emotion. I studied body psychotherapy, uh, the way energy moves through our body and where it gets blocked. That was a very powerful uh, experience for me and for me to also learn about how humanity processes emotions. With my knowledge in body psychotherapy and working through catharsis but in a very safe setup, and her passion, that is the director, is Claire Chabak. She started making films in cathartic realism. So she walks the artist through the process of catharsis on set. And then we have an opportunity in a, in a very contained, safe space to release our emotions and use it for the sake of art. And I feel very passionate about making films because it can reach a wider audience and the visual medium is very powerful. I have complex PTSD, I've been diagnosed with complex PTSD, but I did not choose myself to be a victim of it. I chose it to master it, to overcome it, which is why the name of my film is Resilient. And over the years of having um, amazing therapists who held really loving space for me, they taught me that I could go to the places of trauma but not get locked in that space of trauma, but actually release that emotion and use it in service. And then I just sort of became an expert at it and now I use it for acting because it makes acting feel very real because the emotions feel very real. So there are two very important things in the in the film. One is the process of transformation that I have narrated through dance because dance as movement has always been a very powerful experience. But she doesn't do it by herself. She does it with the character of a husband who holds a loving space and keeps meeting her wherever he is. And the relation to this with fashion for me is that I always found comfort in fabrics. Fabrics make me feel a certain way. And when I was going through my difficult times, I would just comfort myself with fabric. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the relation. And so I chose this street in uh, Soho in New York, which is a fashion street because it was setting up an environment of beauty that is holding pain. And the constant back and forth of going to the street and coming out of it is almost like a reminder of what I'm seeing outside myself is reminding me that I'm, I'm okay on the inside.